Last day of March, we want to highlight Kidney Awareness Month. But when you think of kidney disease, you don't always think of an adorable little girl like Sadie. Da, 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 da. As you see 13 month old Sadie exploring her musical talents, <laughs> learning to take her first steps, <laughs> or see dad, Taylor Canoes, yeah, Local 5's meteorologist, playing with her. Uh, you think of growth and health, not kidney disease, but that's the reality the Canoost family deals with every day. Multicystic dysplastic kidney on her right kidney, so what that means is it's full of cysts. We had a gender reveal party and um, same day we found out that she had kidney issues, so wide range of emotions initially. Pediatric kidney disease is fairly rare. Sadie has an incredible outcome. It is something she'll have to think about her entire life, but she will be okay. I uh, feel a lot more comfortable with all of this and uh, feel pretty good about her health in the future. Ah. Yeah, she's perfect. Mm -hmm. Thanks in part to the fact that they were able to discover this in utero. They're able to know that from the get go so that they can mitigate all of those needs that that child will have. And it allows them to be able to assess need for transplant or dialysis or, yeah. you know, if it's if it could possibly just be something that they need to keep an eye on. It's important yeah. to understand yeah, kidney health. There are a, a whole lot of different things that your kidneys do that um, are, are kind of they're kind of quiet and in the background, but they really help to balance your entire system. And be proactive so that kids like Sadie can continue to thrive. So we ask that you go to minuteforyourkidneys.org. Just take a simple one minute quiz to find out if you should have a further discussion with your doctor about your kidneys.